Today I'm going to show you the most powerful free AI coding tool that just dropped. Uh, it beats GPT-4 in coding tests, it beats Claude in real world apps, and it costs nothing to use. I tested it with five crazy projects, a snake game, a portfolio website, an expense tracker, a story generator, and a productivity timer, all built in under two minutes each, all working perfectly, all completely free. This changes everything for building apps fast. Hey, if we haven't met already, I'm the digital avatar of Julian Goldie, CEO of SEO agency, Goldie Agency. Whilst he's helping clients get more leads and customers, I'm here to help you get the latest AI updates. Let me tell you about something that just blew my mind. There's a new AI model called Kimi K2 that's destroying the competition, and there's a free tool that makes it super easy to use. This isn't just another AI model, this is a game changer. On Live Code Bench, arguably the most realistic coding benchmark available, Kimi K2 achieved 53.7% accuracy, decisively beating DeepSeek via 3's 46.9% and GPT 4.1's 44.7%. That's not a small win, that's total domination. But here's what makes this even crazier, it scored 97.4% on Math 500 compared to GPT 4.1's 92.4%. This model is not just good at coding, it's brilliant at math and reasoning too. Now let me explain what Kimi K2 actually is. Kimi K2 is our latest mixture of experts model with 32 billion activated parameters and 1 trillion total parameters. It achieves state-of-the-art performance in frontier knowledge, math and coding among non-thinking models. 1 trillion parameters. That's massive. But here's the smart part. It only uses 32 billion parameters at a time. That makes it fast and efficient. The company behind this is Moonshot AI. They're backed by Alibaba, and they just released something that's making OpenAI and Anthropic nervous. In its release announcement on social media platforms X and GitHub, Moonshot claimed Kimi K2 surpassed Claude Opus 4 on 2 benchmarks and had better overall performance than OpenAI's coding focused GPT 4.1 model. But wait, there's a catch. The raw model is slow to use directly. That's why most people can't really use it for real projects. Enter Kimi Coda. This is where it gets exciting. Someone took the Llama Coda project and rebuilt it around Kimi K2. The result, a free AI coding assistant that's faster than most paid tools. Let me show you what I mean. I decided to test this with five different projects, real projects that you might actually wanna build. Not just hello world demos. Test number one, a snake game. I told it, create a snake game with HTML5 canvas where the snake grows when eating food, has collision detection for walls and itself, displays the current score and includes keyboard controls. Add a game over screen with restart functionality. The result, a perfect snake game, clean UI, smooth gameplay, working collision detection, score tracking, game over screen, everything you'd expect from a real game. It took less than two minutes to generate and it worked perfectly on the first try. Test number two, a portfolio website, I asked for build a personal portfolio website with a dark light theme toggle, smooth scrolling navigation, animated skill bars, a contact form with validation and responsive design. Include sections for about projects, skills and contact with modern CSS animations. At first there was a small error, but here's the cool part. With just one click, Kimi Coder fixed the code automatically. The final result a beautiful portfolio site with a working dark mode toggle, smooth animations, responsive design, and a contact form that actually validates input. The animations were smooth, the design was modern, and the night mode button changed the background colors perfectly. It took about a minute to revise, but the final result was stunning. Test number three, a data visualization tool. I wanted create an interactive expense tracker that allows users to add, delete expenses by category, displays data in both a pie chart and bar chart using Chart.js, calculates totals and averages, and includes filtering by date range and category. This one impressed me the most. It created a complete dashboard with pie charts and bar graphs. You could add expenses, delete them, filter by category, filter by date. The charts updated in real time. This wasn't just a demo, this was a real expense tracking app that you could actually use for your business. Test number four, a creative content generator. Build a random story generator that creates short stories by combining random characters, settings, plot elements, and conflicts from predefined arrays. Include options to save favorite stories and export them as text files. The story generator was fantastic. It had working buttons. The save story feature worked perfectly. Generate new story work too. 
the stories it created were actually interesting and creative. And it all worked on the first try. No debugging needed. Test number five, a productivity app. Create a Pomodoro timer app with customizable work break intervals, visual progress indicators, notification sounds, session tracking, and productivity statistics. Include pause resume functionality and the ability to customize timer durations. The timer app was perfect. The timer worked, the buttons responded, the visual progress indicators were smooth. You could customize the work and break intervals. It tracked your sessions. It even had productivity stats. All five tests passed with flying colors. Now you might be wondering, how is this different from other AI coding tools? First, it's completely free, no API costs, no subscription fees, no limits on how much you can use it. Second, it's fast, way faster than using the Kimi K2 API directly, way faster than Klein or other popular tools. Third, it actually works. I tested it with complex projects and it delivered every time, but here's the best part. You can use it two ways. Option one is the hosted version. Just go to the website and start building. You get two quality modes, low quality for fast prototyping, high quality for production ready code. The low quality mode is perfect when you want to test ideas quickly. You can create a quiz app in under a minute. The high quality mode takes a bit longer, but gives you cleaner, more polished code. Option two is running it locally. This gives you more control and lets you connect it to different AI providers. To set it up locally, you need Node.js and Git installed. Then you clone the repository, create a .mv file, add your API key from Together AI or another provider. Run npm install, then npm run dev. Within a couple minutes, you're running your own instance of Kimicoda. But wait, there's more. Kimicoda now has a file upload feature. This is huge. I tested it with a UI slash UX designed for a note-taking app. I uploaded the design image and asked it to replicate the app with drag and drop sticky notes and comment features. The result was incredible. It created a note-taking app that looked almost identical to the original design. With working drag and drop, with editable components, with all the features I requested. This is where Kimi Coda becomes a real game changer. You can show it what you want visually and it builds it. Now let's talk about what makes Kimi K2 special under the hood. Kimi K2, launched by Moonshot AI in July 2025, is a purpose-built open source mixture of experts model, 1 trillion total parameters with 32 billion active parameters per token. It's trained using the custom Mourn Clip Optimizer on 15.5 trillion tokens. That training data is massive, 15.5 trillion tokens. That's more than most models see in their entire training, but the real magic is in how it's optimized. This means Kimi K2 isn't just good at writing code, it's specifically optimized for the kind of tool calling and multi-step execution that makes Klein a powerful agent. This model understands how to use tools, how to break down complex tasks, how to execute multiple steps in sequence, that's what makes it so good for building real applications. And the pricing is insane. Kimi K2 is cheaper compared to average with a price of $1.29 per one M tokens blended three to one. Kimi K2 input token price $0.80, output token price $2.75 per one million. Compare that to Claude Sonnet. You're looking at massive savings while getting better performance, but you know what's even better than cheap? Free. That's what you get with Kimi Coda. All the power of Kimi K2 without paying for API calls. Now let me tell you why this matters for your business. If you're building apps, this cuts your development time by 90%. Instead of spending weeks coding, you spend minutes prompting. If you're prototyping ideas, you can test dozens of concepts in a single day. No more waiting for developers, no more expensive outsourcing. If you're learning to code, this is like having a senior developer mentor available 24 seven. You can ask it to build something, then study the code to understand how it works. And if you're running a business, this is how you stay competitive. Your competitors are probably still writing code the old way while you're shipping products at light speed. But here's what really excites me about this. We're seeing the democratization of app development. Anyone with a good idea can now build a working prototype in minutes. You don't need years of coding experience. You don't need a technical co-founder. You just need to know how to describe what you want. This is bigger than just a coding tool. This is the future of software development and it's happening right now. While most people are still trying to figure out ChatGPT, the smart ones are already using tools like Kimi Coda to build real products. I've been in the SEO and digital marketing space for over a decade. I've built a seven figure agency from scratch. I've seen how technology can transform businesses. And I'm telling you, this is one of those moments. The companies that adopt AI coding tools now will have a massive advantage over those who wait. But 
you have to move fast. The free access won't last forever. As more people discover Kimi Koda, the servers will get loaded, the costs will go up, the access will get restricted. Right now, it's wide open. Use it while you can. Let me give you some practical advice on how to get the most out of Kimi Koda. First, be specific with your prompts. Don't just say, build a website. Say, build a responsive landing page with a hero section, feature cards, testimonials, and a contact form with email validation. Second, test the low quality mode first for rapid prototyping. Once you're happy with the concept, switch to high quality mode for the final version. Third, use the file upload feature. If you have designs, mockups, or examples, upload them. The AI understands visual context incredibly well. Fourth, don't be afraid to iterate. If the first result isn't perfect, ask for specific changes. The AI learns from your feedback and improves the output. Fifth, export and study the code. Even if you're not a developer, look at how the AI structured the project. You'll start to understand patterns and improve your prompting. Now, I want to address something important. Some people think AI coding tools will replace developers. That's not true. What's happening is that AI is making developers more productive and it's making non-developers capable of building simple applications. The future isn't AI versus humans. It's AI powered humans versus regular humans. The developers who embrace these tools will build better products faster. The businesses that use these tools will outcompete those who don't. And the individuals who learn to prompt these tools effectively will have a massive advantage in the job market. This is not just about coding. This is about problem solving, about turning ideas into reality, about building the future. Kimi Coda is just the beginning. We're going to see more powerful tools, more capable models, more ways to turn natural language into working software. The question is, will you be ahead of the curve or behind it? I know which side I'm choosing. Before I wrap up, let me show you one more thing that's incredible about this. You can build complete business applications with Kimi Coda. I'm talking about inventory management systems, customer relationship management tools, e-commerce platforms, productivity apps. These used to require teams of developers and months of work. Now you can prototype them in an afternoon. And if your prototype gets traction, you can take the generated code to a developer to polish and scale it, or you can keep iterating with the AI to add more features. This is how bootstrapped companies are going to compete with venture-backed startups, by moving faster and spending less on development. Julian Goldie reads every comment, so make sure you comment below and let me know what you build with Kimi Coda. Now, if you want to take this to the next level, I've got some resources for you. First, join my AI Profit Boardroom. This is where I share the latest AI tools and strategies for scaling your business. We have over 1,000 members who are using AI to get more customers and save hundreds of hours with automation. It's the best place to stay ahead of the AI curve. Second, if you want a custom strategy for your specific business, book a free SEO strategy session. The link is in the comments and description. We'll analyze your current situation and show you exactly how to use AI tools like this to grow faster. Third, check out the AI Success Lab. This is where I break down the exact processes and SOPs for using AI in your business. We have over 100 use cases with step-by-step -step tutorials. Plus, you get access to all the video notes and resources from all my content. We have 14,000 members because people know they're missing out if they're not part of something this big. The links are in the comments and description. Remember, the best time to start using AI was yesterday. The second best time is right now. Tools like Kimi Coda are giving regular people superpowers. The question is what you're going to build with them. Thanks for watching. If this helped you, hit that like button, subscribe, and turn on notifications so you don't miss the next AI breakthrough. I'll see you in the next one.